friends always jump into the boss immediately. God damn it, friend! Comes the, the mythical raid. I'm kind of feeling for Woo right now. There we go. Yes. <laughs> oh my god, pretty impressive actually. Adorable. Yeah, Master Papa Sword! I <laughs> gotta love Travis, he's so adorable. Oh, hello everyone, I'm just really happy guys. I'm happy and I was had to make you know, last sword. <laughs> but I was saying something here, the sign of my life right now, but we're here, right? Just got this one. Uh, but I am just gonna raid me to be my boss. My boss just called me, I had a client meeting last week, right? Uh, that I missed up the bleach. And my boss just called me and said I got the deal, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna design this like really advanced AI now for I can't say too much NDA but I'm just like man I gotta be <laughs> yeah, I had two different stuff yeah last week and I got the I got the AI one so I'm happy but they're both really interesting they're both really interesting but I'm happy that I missed out on the bitch episode but now I got my AI clients so I, I really wanted to you know develop the AI there so Feels good, man. Feels good. But anyway, let's watch the anime. But obviously, I'm gonna point it out. I can't say, can't say too much because it's like security or someone. But I'm like, man, yeah, got another AI up. So now I got like maybe. Oh, I've been like an AI, AI, AI guy like for five years now. So. Oh, time to watch for sword. Mama, yeah. <laughs> God damn it, man. Mama was just crazy, man. They're adding a new mother there. So let's watch thing. It's a three, two, one, and go. Episode 10 of. Fran, her papa sword, her mama, whip lady, yeah. Very, very. Oh, he got a new bad guy with like a cancer immediately. Something happening? Demon eyes? No, it's a spider lady for him. Spider lady in opening, right? The spider lady in the opening. Okay, so finally, done the time. Yeah, we're playing Wolf Guys. I haven't actually played it well. I, saw, I think I'm playing World of Warcraft, right? It released yesterday. Or two days ago, I guess, the time so you mean. Uh, but I haven't actually played it. I'm, I'm, I have played except one expansion, right? I've played all the new expansions. But I just felt that it's probably gonna be the same thing like last time. Where I played for a month, right? Something like that. Buy it, right? Play for a few, a few weeks, do all the new zones, do the dungeons, and get tired of it. Yeah. Uh, it's hard, honestly, right? To get that excitement you used to have, right? For like World of Warcraft. I don't know, guys. What do you think? Uh, I am been thinking about it for the last, last two days though, playing the new Wolf expansion, but I'm just like, uh. <laughs> But yeah, you kind of want to do it, right? It feels weird, honestly, not doing it, because yeah, you're really used to, like, honestly, you're used to playing it, but... Now, but now when I see them enter this dungeon, I'm just like, yeah, dungeon time, raid! <laughs> yeah, let's kill the spider raid, boss, mythic raid, plus! Yeah, I'm thinking immediately they will work it, honestly. Um, I don't know people, everyone... Keeps telling me that right, all the time, right? Oh, you gotta play Final Fantasy, but I just, I just, <laughs> I'm too afraid. Yeah, I was like, I can't do it, guys. I'm gonna go freaking crazy if I play Final Fantasy. To be honest here, I'm gonna go crazy to play Final Fantasy. Yeah. People tell me F14, right? You gotta play F14, and I'm like, no, it's too much. I'm gonna go insane. Um, but yeah, damn it. I really do kind of things. Honestly, if I could play with Warcraft, not having to pay for it, honestly, it, was, it, it used to be too expensive to buy a. It's like the, it costs monthly, right? And it's costing, you know, a full game. And I kind of want to play that much, I feel. Play that much for a game I know I'm going to probably play it in a few weeks. But here we go. So now they're raiding. A friend is all like, hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm. Yes, yes. I have to say, I am a little bit, this teasing me to go, go, go and play World of Warcraft now. Yeah. It massively is, right? Seeing them entering a dungeon and so on. Raiding and so on. Yeah, it is hard not. To, it is honestly very hard not to be like, damn it! I also want to go and raid. It certainly feels like that. Yeah. yeah I also want my milf. Uh, <laughs> I also want my milf lady to be like, oh, let's go, honey bunny. I want that. Who is my milf lady helping me in the dungeons? Come on. Um. But yeah, you see all the stats and so on. Whatever you know, see all the different stats. Yeah. I know Fran's gonna do, sorry, no Fran, I mean Mama's gonna do a lot of this, like, oh, I remember back when, <laughs> yeah, she's an old, old lady, she's gonna be like, oh yeah, back in my days, of course she's gonna do all of this, like, you know, yeah, typical, like, yeah, Sen Sen, She's very, she's very Arara, yeah. She's just like, oh, Arara, honey. <laughs> oh, don't you think bother you, sweetie. Get a final enemies. They're spiders, right? Because it's like a spider uh, dungeon. 
I mean, clearly the bad uh, the raid boss is like a spider later, right? It's like an arachne, so yeah, clearly gonna be spiders. Makes sense, like our babies, uh, low level spiders right in the beginning. Yeah, makes perfect sense. So you cannot see the eye. I mean, clearly the spiders are CDI. Yeah, they definitely stick out in the. Definitely are. Yeah, you can. But at least he can fight them. Yeah, he could own less every soul, but at least he can at least he can beat spiders. Yeah, he's not useless at least. Yeah, he's killing the you know, destroying the spiders with his spear attacks. <laughs> Aniki! So at least Aniki isn't completely useless. <laughs> it's okay! <laughs> yeah, it's like you get mom's approval. <laughs> he's just like Mama is proud of you, honey. It's like okay, good. Good. There you have, uh, yeah. Oh, she mom's approval. Very good. Oh, now the waifu goes, yeah, like op big oppa elf lady, whatever she's there. Yeah. But it's so anime <laughs> how she gets stuck in the web, right? And it pushed up her, her pushed up her op oppa, it's right there. Yeah, it's like the, the web being kind of pushed forward her uh, boobs, right? I was like, very good anime. Um, but I mean, so far, this is kind of it's too easy for them, right? I guess. Yeah, a friend just stands there and looks confused, right? Fred is bored because he hasn't done anything yet. It was too easy for him. <laughs> yeah, so far it's too easy, right? It must be now of Black Clover when you get the first time in Black Clover. I mean, visually standpoint, it's kind of similar. It's kind of that... Yeah, you know, kind of vegetable, kind of ruined, ruined thing. Of course, he didn't love other enemies too, so right? Man, I would definitely go back and play World of Warcraft 9 if I could have a huge MILF. Yeah, if I could have a, my, my mama. Yeah, if I could have this character in my raid party. It's all like, yay, honey! <laughs> that constant, they would be like, Can you please let me hug you! Yeah. <laughs> I would, then I would definitely play any of more Brigade if I could get the... Uh, where's my, yeah, where's my big ass... Uh, be, uh, come on. Yeah. But I mean, she is the strongest. So she can explain to friends and stuff yeah, how it's... How you get stronger and so on. Oh, this is like a so kind of bug, I guess. A beetle bug turning into like. Oh yeah, exactly. They touch it too. But so far he actually is useless though. Let's say he, he was so point. Yeah, he got owned. <laughs> but I like how he's ignoring him. <laughs> he's trying to, and Mama is giving advices. Yeah, he's trying jumping around in the background doing cool stuff. They're like whatever. He's an idiot. Yeah, <laughs> it's like trying to get some. Trying to get the ladies look at him, and they're like, yeah, whatever, whatever, shut up over here. I'm trying to teach uh, Fran a lesson here, I'm trying to explain to her magic or whatever. Um, but like I said, right, yeah, now, you know, now Mama isn't used in a sense, because she's giving her advice and explaining to her, hara, hara. Yeah, she's trying to explain to her how to level up or whatever, or, you know, how talents works or whatever, right, yeah. Trying to give her some advice and different stuff, and so on. So for this, like, I'm watching definitely like a tutorial for an RPG game. <laughs> so this is how you play the game, honey. This is how it works and so on. Yeah, I was like, I see, I see. Hmm. Oh, traps. I guess so. Yeah, he was in the traps. <laughs> we said CD first! Oh, I love it! Now I press the red button, there's like a trap, right? Yeah, she's not very intelligent. Now don't press the red... She literally pressed the red button, or like the red... Uh... Yeah, so now they're walking into a lot of traps here. <laughs> oh my god, it's enemies. Man, they really hate this poor guy, man. Yeah, he is... Uh... He was just kind of a rude episode, and now he's getting all the damage. He's getting all the abuse, man. Yeah, and they're both just like, it's too easy for us. <laughs> my, my god, both a man and a friend are like, pff, weaklings. He's kind of dodgy, man. Ah, oh, he goes to kind of uh, dungeon scam thing. Yeah, you can see stuff. Why did he do that first? What a douchebag. Why did, he, why did he do it first? Why was he like, okay, guys, I took care of it. And they're like, yeah, thanks, but you could have started with that. You could have started using the scan ability, like the, the trap finder, before we all got hit by traps, right? He's like... Yeah, I could have done that, I guess. <laughs> he um, definitely could have done that before. 
I feel that I was like complete douchebaggery, honestly. Like, why didn't he start doing that? Yeah, why, why was he like afterward? He was like, oh yeah, sorry about that, guys. This is this is how you want the traps. So yeah, I was like, and Amanda just keeps giving advice to Fran. Yeah, she just keep um, throwing out some good old mama advices. Uh, most more or less, right? Yeah, more or less. Hmm. Yeah, so far it's very like, oh, suddenly some sexy elf though. <laughs> the explanation is like, uh, by the way, let me talk about this uh, cute elf girl. Yeah, it's like, okay, let me explain it by showing you like a cute, uh, yeah, uh, you see this sexy elf lady? <laughs> I feel this, I'm all complaining, I'm just like, why, why is suddenly a sexy elf lady coming in in her explanation? She's like, here's a picture, imagining you being a sexy elf lady with big boobs. You're like, okay, mom, it's like, why, why is this happening? <laughs> <laughs> why is it? Why not? Yeah, it's not a character to ex explain to yourself. But yeah, Fran gets it. Fran is like Wakata, Wakata. Fran gets it 100%, guys. Definitely. Man, I guess the spider mama is really... But I mean, she's a spider boss, raid boss, right? She got like a million children, of course. Start right. Yeah, I got some earth magic. I have to say, the episode is. I'm bored, guys. I mean, I love this anime, but this episode is a little bit. Uh, it's very like. This is how the route works. This is how. It's been like 10 minutes now, and the thing is explaining stuff to Fran. Like, this is how you combine this magic. This is how you craft uh, this sword or whatever. It, yeah, it's like, I mean, it's somewhat interesting, it gives up, it underspells a little bit of the world building. But this is where I feel, as an end watcher, right, this to me is where you feel it's based on a light novel, because it's like, mostly a lot of text explaining, you know, this, 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 this is a very typical light novel, where, where the author is like, let me explain you the world rules strat. I'm gonna explain to you, this is how you level up, this is how you combine magic, this is how the territory looks. This is very like novel feeling, right? Where the character like ten minutes to explain all the roots or whatever. Um, so you kind of get about the episode one again, where you also had a lot. Of... So yeah, episode one also had more of this, you know. Let me explain extinct to you. Uh, uh, feel to it, right? Um, yeah, but it, but but I think it's a very common thing you see in light novels where they where they feel like okay, now I need to explain curry to you. <laughs> Here we go, curry time. Hara hara honey! This is the best for that. Hara hara! That's my daughter! <laughs> yeah, that is now little mama daughter curry. Yeah, mama curry! <laughs> they have this like weird moment when they eat curry together. It's just like, yay, I love you! Yeah, it's like, okay. This is the wholesome Fran Manor moment in the background there. They're like, what's happening over there? What is this uh, curry thing? Yeah, what is this amazing thing that we call uh, the curry? <laughs> We're like, okay. Hi, friends. It really is a teacher now, yeah. It's like, let me tell you how now it works. Yay, mommy! <laughs> it really is like, hi, I want to I wanna give you the answer, mommy. Um. Hmm. This is for building up another character, yeah, the strongest. Kind of like the guild master when he was young, maybe. I don't know, the hair was, maybe. Maybe, it's like still wet ish. A little bit looking like the guild master, but probably not. Yeah, now Fran is being over. She's her, her brain. Her brain is breaking now. It's, it's it's too much info for Fran. Yeah, it's too much information, mom. So I feel too 
It's too much information. It's like reading a whole game mod manual. This is like read the game manual. Yeah, this is like here. Here's the whole Pokemon manual. Take it up and read it. You know, there's the yeah. Take the whole Pokemon manual and read it now. It's explain all the game, all the types of whatever. That's kind of how it feels, right? It's kind of <laughs> having uh, a Mama Amanda just explaining everything in the whole game for me. I wasn't really sure how the game worked, now, guys. <laughs> beauty, beauty, you're afraid she show, aren't you? Uh, that was adorable, yeah. Fran is like calling out. <laughs> What's happening? Dummy, she show! <laughs> what is this? The master! Oh my god, what's happening? They had this like mental cuteness battle. And I was looking at it like she's like, oh, God, I'm weird though. And everyone's like, what's wrong with me? She's mentally insane. Yeah, she's like, why is she so happy with your sword for it? Everyone is like, there's something mentally wrong with this girl. She's like, oh, I love you, Katana Shan. <laughs> oh, my beloved sword. Yeah. Everyone is like, why, why is she hugging your sword for like it's a person? What's well, mentally broken with this little girl? Yeah. <laughs> they all looked at her like, Man, that, that lady is insane. Yeah, they were like, man, she has had like screw loose, right? Oh god, oh, that's adorable. Yeah, now she's back being crazy again. Oh, I love it. Yeah, they were all looking at her like she had uh, mental issues. <laughs> but seriously, yeah, they were all like, oh, I see. Do you think the girl had mental issues? Yeah, that, she's doing something weird with the sword over there. I see. She got issues. That makes sense. They also keep killing spiders. I mean, so far it's very easy for them. Yeah, they just killed everything. They had a trap guy, but they wasn't gonna have the like, anti trap medics with easy anyway when he just used it after he let the guys take the damage rush. But yeah, so far they only the spiders. It's a bigger spider, I guess. So much bigger spider. But yeah, it is. <laughs> I don't know. I'm mad there being a hot milf. Yeah. She said, don't edit again. She's like, oh, you go. Like, what, what is she? She leading? I don't know. Amanda's just there being, like, attractive. She's, being, she's just, uh, just standing there, like, supporting them by being hot, man. She's just like, I'm the sexy milf, yeah. <laughs> it's like, what's she doing in the fight? Nothing. Literally, had done nothing so far. She has straight up only done, like, oh, you guys, you're so cool. Ah. Uh. What's it now then? Oh, it's more spiders with the blue instead. Yeah, I guess it's changing color spiders now. Man, this dungeon really has. The done the, the raid mama, she really is producing a lot of. Oh, a cuckoo, that's cool. Yeah, she really is producing a lot of spiders. That woman has a lot of babies. It's out of potions. It is pretty cool now, it looks like an actual game. It's like, oh, I only had five potions with me, it's too expensive to buy more. Yeah, it's like, I can't just farm all the time, man. I, don't have, I can't afford all these potions. Think of me. <laughs> it's like, come on, man, it's expensive. Um... Yeah, but of course, Fran can heal it. Fran is OP, man. <laughs> and I was keeping I was like, yeah! <laughs> I can kick here on Doku! That's good. Fran can do a lot of stuff. Yeah, she's quite OP right, with her sword uh, best friend, Papa. Ah, uh, let's see what gets together. The scene that she was like, oh, I love you, daddy. <laughs> she was bad. But everyone looked at her like she was wrong with her. Why is she standing there like talking to her sword by herself? Yeah, it's like, oh, God, yeah, you're right. She's like, why? Oh, I see. This, this little girl, she's very powerful, but she's mentally insane. Yeah, it's like, now she can talk to her sword, man. It's worth a lie, yeah. Ah, it was adorable. It was adorable scene. It was adorable. Oh, master. But yeah. 
I have to say, I'm sorry, but I, I've been pondering if I should play Wub now for two weeks, uh, two days, I mean, <laughs> for two days and after before that. And seeing this dungeon, though, I, I do feel a little bit like, damn it, I want to get on the the raid, you know, be surrounded by the enemies, and it's, I, I play Death Knight mostly, so I'm like, to get my blood death going, use tank all the spiders, you know, save the raid, yeah. Can I want to have that, yeah, I want to, okay, finally Mama's gonna fight something, finally. Yeah, I'm mad that we're standing there just watching them for a the whole raid. Man, she's terrible. Yeah, she's attractive. She's just a hot character. Um, think about it, she's the strongest person here, though. Yeah, she's just very, like... Is she also the strongest, you know, person in the raid? Yeah, she's just like, oh, I'm gonna help out. I'm just gonna stand here and just be like, hey, hey, hey. Are they leaving? They're running away. They got crazy. They got some poison on them. Yeah, some red curse on them. I'm running through the traps with Franis. Oh my god, Franshan! Yeah, Franshan! I knew it! Of course, the man's gonna be like, my little girl! Yeah. But they hit by some brain. No, they're falling into the trap now. Yeah, it was teleported trap. Interesting. She sure! Yeah, Fran falls in the spider trap. He's probably sending her through the boss or something by itself. It's a classic friend, man. She probably gets to the boss and be like, Oh, I gotta sue the boss again? Uh, what? No! She sure? It's like, oh, wait a minute, stupid trap? <laughs> that was interesting. That was interesting. Yeah, the trap teleported away without. Yeah, interesting trap. The trap disarms you. So it teleports you, but it also teleports you with your weapon. Man, that's big for Fran. Lost her papa. But I guess Amanda is gonna pick up this. Yeah, she's gonna pick up, of course, the sword, right? Exactly. She's like, this sword is important for my daughter. She's gonna pick it up, of course. Will they talk now, then? Yeah, interesting if they're gonna team up. This is an even stronger team up now. Amanda and the sword. This could be even. This is like the legit hardest, <laughs> strongest combo to have. This could be really powerful, then, if he's like, hey, girl, I can talk, and we are really. I can give you all my magic. Yeah, like. This might make Amanda the strongest person alive or something now, if she gets a sword right. Yeah. Interesting trap. Obviously a very powerful trap against uh, Fran there. As she got her own yeah, living sword master guy, gives her half her magic basically. Right? And those guys are probably... I mean, yeah, they lost their weapons too, right? So... This, is, is, is it the Spider Queen? See, I told you, yeah, it's typical Fran, man! Oh, sexy spider lady. A typical Fran to like immediately meet the raid boss. Fran is like got him cheating over. She's always she always find issues, yeah. But I mean Fran <laughs> I like a laughter immediately. This is so Fran too to immediately is like, oh I'm with the raid boss guys, yeah. Every time Fran, Fran is like, I got to the raid boss immediately. God damn it, Fran, stop taking the shortcuts. Um I call it man, I knew Fran was gonna get teleported to the raid boss. I will he talk to Amanda now? He's like, hey lady. Crazy mama, can we team up? We gotta save our daughter, right? Man, yeah, so Fran surrounded by the, all the spiders. <laughs> but I love how I call it. I was like, come on, this Fran, she will immediately get teleported to the spider mama. Yeah, she's gonna get the spider mama. It's like, instead of doing it down, she's like, oh, I'm at the boss already. Let's <laughs> review it. I was, that was cool, man. That was cool. Yeah, she's like, <laughs> you fell for my trap, stupid humans. And the cat girl, but who cares? Uh, but that was a cool scene. She kind of grew out of the spider, right? She kind of, this is massive spider body. It's obviously like a typical arachne, right? It's like this kind of, you know, spider lady, arachne, you know, something like that, right? Ar arachnoid, whatever they call this anime, right? Um... Reminds me a lot, I will say. I can't talk about Wu, but it's released, right? But honestly, it reminds me a lot of... But even the colors. There is this... What's it called? Shindor, Shindorai, whatever it's called. The Nightfall. Like, yeah, yeah. There's so many goddamn Wu expansions. But you have the Wu expansions that... Um, Shindor... I can't pronounce the name right. But it's this this, this elf that has been uh, transformed with spiders, right? So they're kind of blue spiders. And a lot of them are like this, yeah. They're kind of the half spider, half uh, woman, right? Yeah, many of them are women. <laughs> Some of them are men too, but they're mostly ladies, right? Yeah. 
Um, and you have this done game, and you have to run around and do. You have to like defeat number of spiders in a time thing, whatever. Actually, a pretty good game mechanic in World Walking. One of my favorite, actually. Yeah, this you have to like get. I don't know. It's basically a gauntlet run, right? Yeah, like ten minutes on you, and you can do it once per day, and it's basically you know kill the ass man and spider boss as you can, blah blah blah. Uh, honestly, I think one of the better gameplays in that game I ever had, actually. But uh, but anyway, yeah, very very gamey, right? But I recommend it. Very very gamey though this episode. I mean, I liked it. But I will say that it felt a little slower, right, than the fifth episode. Definitely did. I mean, it felt more episode one, right, as I mentioned on the rest of where, I mean, it's kind of fine introducing, you know, Amanda is basically Fran's mom, right? She's like, okay, I'm your mom now. I'm going to explain to you how this works, how you combine this magic, how you level up or whatever. Right? She's kind of giving Fran kind of like all that, her advice, right? Which, from a story, it makes sense, right? She basically adopted Fran last episode, right? And even though Fran is very powerful, she's kind of young and naive and doesn't really know what's up, right, with the actual strategies and so on. Uh, you know, she's just kind of intuitively very powerful, right? And also, of course, she has the Inbound Sword. But even without the sword, you know, Fran is very like, intuitively, you know, adept, right? Uh, so, you know, Mama Amanda is like, okay, let me explain to you the game, uh, you know, how it works, right? So it, it makes sense. But definitely the episode, as I mentioned earlier, it feels very like novel, right? It feels very much like a chapter where the author explains all the game rules. And I think that... The episode is fine. It's not a terrible episode, but I mean, like I said earlier, it's episode one, right? It reminds me of episode one. It's kind of like, here are the game rules. Less, you know, not much action, not so much jokes either. And I don't think, it, and, I, and I think it's fair to say that because it's not, it's not like, it's not like I need this constant action, right? I don't need like, oh my God, that's blah, blah, blah. That's not my point, right? It's more that this episode also had the least amount of jokes, probably. I would say that, that, that probably, yeah. I would, I would say it's the week episode, episode one, definitely. Because it also had the least amount of jokes. Like, I love that scene, right? When Fran, of course, was talking to, you know, a Sword in, you know, in its cute scene. And then was like, what's, what's she doing? She's like, oh my god, yeah. And this is here, yeah, yeah, this was hilarious, yeah. Because they have, they have, they're having a mental talk, right? They're talking telepathically, and it's all adorable. Oh, master, let's do this thing, oh, I love you. And everyone, Amanda, all the guys are like, what is she doing? Yeah, he's like, hey, hey, hey Sword, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no. Best friend ever, I love you, Papa. You know, she's doing all this like, adorable, adorable, you know, discussion with him, right? And everyone else is like, man, that that girl gonna screw loose, man. Yeah, she's mentally insane. <laughs> so, but that's what I mean, right? The, the episode was decent, but yeah, it, it definitely lacked the jokes and also the brutality. Yeah, uh, so I'm so very negative. No, but I think it was fine. But but I think it's worth to point out that it really is that I feel it's very typical for these light novels that they're gonna have. An episode or two, which is like, okay, let me tell you all the game rules. Yeah, this is all the storyline. This is all the, here's all the talent trees. Like, let me draw the map to you. <laughs> you know what I mean? It is one anime that I was called Kumuko. I'm a spider. She was like, every episode was like, oh, I got 50 new abilities. So let's go over all the abilities. Yeah, that anime was like, enjoyable, but my god. Sometimes it went on like rants about talent trees, right? Or whatever. Yeah, like, basically, here's all my talents. Uh, <laughs> you're like, oh my god. Uh, yeah, she was all like gushing over her abilities, right? Uh, but in that anime, they, they, I think they made it more funny too, though, because Kumuko, which of course Aoyuki voicing her, was all like, <laughs> she was like, she was like making it funny, right? Because her voice is so so genki and quirky, right? She's like, oh, it's fireball, it's different. like that, for like twenty minutes, right? So it was it's enjoyable listening to her just switching. <laughs> it just worked. It just worked anyway. It really worked. Um, Man, we got to subscribe, slap button, and I'll see you guys soon with Mob Psycho, which is supposed to be the best arc science of forever.